Over the weekend, General Motors announced they'd be closing the Flex Line assembly plant in Oshawa. 2,000 people will be thrown out of work. That's 2,000 family supporting jobs gone, and 1,000 more in spin off jobs gone. Now, with this announcement, Canada's manufacturing industry suffers yet another major blow. Now, where is the Conservatives' plan for protecting the manufacturing sector, for protecting Canadian jobs? Mr. Speaker, our budget shows that we take to heart the Canadian economy as well as the needs of Canadians with regard to the manufacturing industry. It's important to note that what we have done recently for the past few years is to reduce their taxes and income taxes. It's important because we want entrepreneurs, manufacturers, those creating jobs to have more money in their pockets to create wealth in the country, Mr. Speaker. We have adopted uh, tax credits as well. 50% uh, for uh, the purchase of equipment. I could uh, name more, Mr. Speaker. I would have run out of time. I could name a few too, Mr. Speaker. Electromotive Diesel, Caterpillar, uh, John Deere, and now GM yet again. Now, we're talking about family supporting jobs. The finance minister himself said, and I quote, automotive engineers, assembly workers, and parts manufacturers are the foundation of many communities like my riding in Whitby, Oshawa. Has the minister given up on his riding? Mr. Speaker, since the government took power, the manufacturing sector has collapsed. 600,000 manufacturing jobs gone. Why has this government abandoned Canadian manufacturing? Yeah. The Honourable Minister of State. Mr. Speaker, we all know that it's not the NDP's policies. They are talking about more taxes, more expenditures, and more income taxes. And we know those won't help the manufacturing sector in Canada. It is not by putting Canadians in further debt with another credit card. Uh, that will ensure that we will create wealth in Canada. Mr. Speaker, in our economic action plan, there are more than 600,000 net new jobs that have been created in Canada. This is a fact, and these are realistic and pragmatic policies for entrepreneurs, unlike what the opposition is saying. This is, that is something that will kill jobs, not create them. Green rate.